<laughs> hey there friends, how's it going? I'm Ben Snow. Today we're doing something a little bit different. Today we're gonna recreate a walk that was featured in Hogwarts Legacy's gameplay showcase, but in Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix. I think it's a great way to compare what we had before to what we have now. And I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. All right, so there's no Hufflepuff common room in this game because uh, no one cares about them, and why would they? <laughs> no one ever cares about Hufflepuffs. They just go into the Forbidden Forest every night. Anyway, so we're gonna just uh, put Harry right here in the corner because that's kind of where it is in the showcase. So we're gonna pretend we're walking around, right? We're walking around in the Hufflepuff common room. Oh my God, it looks beautiful. Fantastic. Wow, 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 wow and then the kitchens, and then he goes up the spiral staircase. And these are not spiral, this is the grand staircase, by the way, which looks very different. Because we got these, this is basically a movie uh, replica recreation stuff. And, but it doesn't really make sense because it's very, it's like a rectangle. And this is in a circular tower. Hogwarts Legacy version, I feel like, makes more sense. And obviously here, staircases just turn, like, just you know, 90 degrees, but in Hogwarts Legacy, it looks like they're like spiral ones that appear from below your feet. I, I think that's pretty cool. Then he walks into the entrance hall, which is right here, and it's very different. Like here, we have the statue of, I believe, one of the founder of Hogwarts. I'm not quite sure who he is. I don't remember. There's no hourglasses, obviously. To the right, we also have the Great Hall, which in Hogwarts, in the showcase, they didn't go to. But we can come in and take a look here. It looks absolutely beautiful. Here, we have it more elongated. And there, we have some space added to the sides. This is more of a movie replica. And in Hogwarts Legacy, it's more of a book replica, if that makes sense. <laughs> But we got fire fireplace here. We got the torches hanging on the walls, floating candles. I'm sure there's gonna be the the ceiling. I mean, if if they could do, come on, no, not that there. No, don't don't touch that. If they could do that ceiling there here, <laughs> then I'm sure it's gonna be there as well. And then in the showcase, the the entrance hall is split into two areas, more like in the Philosopher's Stone movie. Here, for example, it's you just walk straight outside in right into the courtyard. And look at it, oh my god. This what was before, and this is what we have now. I mean, <laughs> it just gets me so excited, the fact that this is gonna be our game. This is what we're gonna be exploring. But regardless, let's continue. Come on, give me, oh, let me out. See, the benefit of this game, you can attack people and then get into a fight. Let's see. Oh no, I'm, I'm losing right away. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if we're gonna be able to do that in Hogwarts Legacy. They didn't showcase any of that. You know, we, we definitely can like duel in the, um, in the clock tower by talking to, what's his name? I forgot. Right. So we can do that type of stuff. Uh, we can we can levitate benches. I don't know if we can do that, but we can always have this game to do that if Hogwarts Legacy doesn't have it. All right, then we go outside into the viaduct bridge. Obviously, multiple levels added here in Hogwarts Legacy. There's a tree with dirigible plums and stuff. It's really cool. Here is just this viaduct, just very narrow, kind of movie-like replica in a way. It still look beautiful, even today, I feel like, but I mean, when you look at Hogwarts Legacy's footage, it's like, oh my god. But then when we go into the... Here it's called Viaduct Entrance. Uh, and it's very different from how it is in Hogwarts Legacy. In Hogwarts Legacy, it is now called the Central Hall which is a, like a hub for students where they gather around and where they access most of the classrooms. Here, see like the potions are through here, through this little tunnel that go into, into the dungeons. Hello. Severus Snape. Snape, Snape. Severus Snape. All right, so that, that, those are the potions. But yeah, here you can go either to the uh, Myrtle's bathroom or Transfiguration Courtyard. 
which is actually very close to how it is in Hogwarts Legacy. You're like, oh my god, it's so cool. I love this courtyard. Like, the essence is there. We got this central piece here. It's not a fountain in Hogwarts Legacy. It is, but we got the tree. You can climb branches here as Harry is doing. And you can also talk to people or, and, or battle them. This one doesn't want to fight. That's a good idea. And then from here, they go to the Defense Against the Dark Arts Tower, but also um, the library. It's not where it is in Hogwarts Legacy. The library is right here in Order of the Phoenix. There's the great gray lady right there. And yeah, um, in Hogwarts Legacy, it has more of a grand entrance to the library. I really like it. It has this that sleeping dragon on top. And uh, here you can also play some wither chess. I guess uh, technology that doesn't exist today anymore. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, yeah, it's wizard chess is not the biggest thing, but for some, it is. Anyways, let's go to the Defense Against the Dark Arts classroom. I think it can be accessed somehow through here. I do know this castle decently. I, it's like that there is a map downloaded in my brain <laughs> from playing this game so many times. Yeah, I know this place. See, look at that. This is Defense Against the Dark Arts. We just go up this uh spiral staircase and here we are hello oh so look at that look at that just the essence just it, it looks almost identical it looks almost identical it's just upgraded triple a version of of, of this this is fantastic, but the thing is, what I love about Hogwarts Legacy that we do get the upgraded version of the castle, but we also get so much more than the story that we knew we, we know. We're now going to be exploring different locations, we're now going to go to the open world, do Goblin Rebellion stuff, discover ancient magic, do all of this. Plus we get this incredible model, incredible version of Hogwarts. Oh, hello, there's Umbridge office. And she's not here because this is where I already uh, I already beat the game <laughs> at this point. So we got everything here. But uh, yeah, I wonder if we can access this uh, office in Hogwarts Legacy. All right, let's get outside. But the location is slightly different. They added the Defense Against the Dark Arts Hall, which looks, oh my God, it looks so good. All right, now from, if I remember correctly, uh, by the way, I'm not actually seeing the, <laughs> their showcase. I'm just replaying it in my mind because I know it already by heart. Let's see, uh, after that, Defense Against the Dark Cards, they went on a little bridge. Okay, so that's actually below this tower. If we go all the way down, there's going to be a little wooden hanging bridge that connects the two wings of Hogwarts. That's where we're going to. And I love the fact that it's there. That it's in Hogwarts Legacy because I was afraid they are going to change that. But no, hello. Hello. It's right here. It's it's here. But of course, in Hogwarts Legacy, you get this beautiful flyover of, uh, of students on the brooms. And we can see so far the other parts of the castle. And here we have this pixelated... A uh, mountain or whatnot. <laughs> Beautiful. I'm, it just makes me so excited. Just seeing locations that we already kind of know, but in the new upgraded way, in, from the different perspective. Then they go to this stone bridge, which in Order of the Phoenix is in a different location. is actually right here. Hello. It is. It's so weird that it is where it is because... Architecturally, that doesn't make any sense at all <laughs> to where it is. Because we got technically from ground floor all the way up. It doesn't make any sense. We cannot control the camera here, so we cannot look at the owlry. But we can do some editing magic, and here it is. Here's the owlry. It's gorgeous. It's beautiful. We cannot look at it entirely, but still, it is there. <laughs> 
Let's continue from here. We go to the clock tower building. And this is the clock tower. This is how it looks today. At least in the top part. Hello. So, of course, um, in Hogwarts Legacy, we come in from there, but there's nothing here. And let's pretend we are walking from there, and voila! The clock tower... I'm so tired today. <laughs> it's absolutely empty here. Well, there is the portrait of this, I forgot her name, and you can unlock, I already have things unlocked here, uh, the, uh, the banners. But even look at the look closer at the I don't know what's it, what's it called the clock thing it, it, the design it's almost identical but of course in, in much more detail and but like here in Hogwarts Legacy there's so much going on we got these we got this armor we got a mount for a horse there's this giant armor for for like a troll there's some crates Th this area is huge and uh, uh, well it must be because we can do dual practices in here but now as the final thing they all run outside to the wooden bridge and let's do it here all right Did you see go oh my god Yes! And he pauses here to look at the owl. We cannot do that. But we can continue running at least. And boom! Obviously we cannot see... We cannot see um, Hogwarts from here. There are some trees, but yes, we did the recreation. This is awesome. Obviously, Hogwarts Legacy has amazing, fantastic views. There, it, this game is not even close to how Hogwarts Legacy looks, and I'm sure there's going to be so much more things to do in it. But what it doesn't have, it doesn't have Hagrid. All right, Harry. All right, Harry. All right, guys. Let me know what, how do you like this comparison? If you would like me to compare maybe other games to, uh, to Hogwarts Legacy's thing. And I will definitely be doing comparisons and playthroughs once Hogwarts Legacy comes out. So make sure to uh, click that like button, subscribe button, and all the other buttons of that nature. I will continue playing this game uh, after I'm done recording. I'll see you next time. All right, who wants to fight? You'll pay for that! Oh, you'll pay for that! Stupefy! I don't think that's funny to you.